Hello listeners. Welcome back to Storytime FM. In this video we will be exploring r slash askredit. Which movie would have been way better if it had a sex scene? Let's jump right in. A Quiet Place. I want to see them having sex while consciously avoiding clapping sounds. Let's look at some more comments. Cars. Would answer some questions. Who framed Roger Rabbit? Spider-Man, No Way Home. The sexual tension between Spider-Man, Spider-Man and Spider-Man was off the charts. Austin Powers the spy who shagged me. Let's see what other comments there are. The Incredibles. This threads made me realize Disney has a whole new market they could tap into. Flash Gordon. The whole thing plays like the scenes leading up to sex in a porno anyway. Monty Python and the Holy Grail. Zoot, in the castle. Let's see what other comments there are. Cast Away. The Mask, 1994. This is one of the weirdest threads I have seen. Thundergun Express 4. Maximum Cool. The man doesn't even hang dong and also I didn't get the plot. Let's see what some other people wrote. Big Hero 6 We all wanted to see the ant get her back blown out over that counter. The Lion King. Nala was definitely giving Simba those eyes in the jungle. Berserk's Golden Ark Trilogy. In the second movie, add the actual sex scene in its entirety. As crazy as it sounds, that scene is one of the most genuinely important and thought-provoking moments in the entire series. In the movie, Guts and Casca just strip down and do it. In the original, manga, they start. But Guts's trauma from being sexually assaulted as a child causes him to start choking Casca in a rage. He walks away ashamed, but finally admits to her what happened to him, and he even cries about how weak he was. She proceeds to hug him and thank him for telling her, before she shares her story about being sexually abused as well. Edit. As one commenter pointed out, I got that wrong, she had already shared her trauma a bit before that. It ends in Guts deciding he wants to try and push through the trauma, and it's genuinely one of the only sex scenes I can think of that literally does nothing but build on the story, and it's a genuinely beautiful part. As much as I like the movies personally, they were my introduction. In retrospect, the gutting of that scene is so awful, and it takes away so much from Guts and Casca's character. In the movie, it was just another one of those awkward and out-of-place sex scenes that felt more forced than authentic. Shrek. Here are some more comments I found. Star Wars Episode 5 It would make Episode 6 more. Interesting. Toy Story. Andy's mum deleted Scene 4. King Kong. Wally and Eve going hammer to Sprocket. Let's see what some other people wrote. Crossing over. A long sex scene of Alice Eve was cut out. HTTP colon slash slash www.money dash into dash light dot com slash twenty thirteen slash zero four slash and dash interview dash with dash Wayne dash Kramer dash part dash two dot HTML and X two hundred B. Was your version more sexually explicit? Yeah. A big sex scene between Alice Eve and Jim Sturgis didn't make it into the movie. The sex scenes between Alice and Ray Liotta were way more explicit than you see in the final movie, including full frontal nudity from Alice. 
I was really upset that we lost a lot of the dialogue in the scene where they negotiate the terms of their deal. Once Alice's character realized the bind she was in, she tried to protect herself by telling him what sexual acts she would and wouldn't do. For example, she wouldn't put a bag overhead, she wouldn't do certain kinky acts, etc. They cut out all that interesting dialogue. Harvey was constantly trying to make her character more sympathetic, and I thought it was a mistake. Toy Story, sex toys were totally underutilized in that movie. Jurassic Park Howard the Duck Here are some more comments I found. Saw B-Movie Harry Potter and the Deeply Hallows Part 1 and 2 Despicable Me. Massive Yellow Group Sex. Let's look at some more comments. How to Train Your Dragon. I'm obligated to say Zootopia. Emoji Movie Does It Really Need One? No Would It Be Mathematically Speaking Infinitely More Enjoyable? Yup. The room. Oh wait, it did have a sex scene. In fact, it had two. The exact same scene, twice. Let's look at some more comments. Coyote Ugly. Star Wars. Luke and Leia. The line, Luke at that speed will you be able to pull out in time? Will have a whole new meaning, and then two movies later, they find out. Black Widow. I mean, they aren't really sisters. Big Six or whatever the movie was called. Let's see what other comments there are. Frozen. Spy Kids and No Not Because of the Kids, Antonio Banderas and Carla Gugino probably have sex that would make gods jealous. Sorts by Controversial Batman and X-200B. All of them. Let's look at some more comments. The Life of Pi Spider-Man No Way Home. Aunt May Solo Scene Please. Folded Hands Back to the Future. Cars 2. Let's look at some more comments. The X Files movie. You know what movie would have been better without a sex scene? That stupid hot dog movie with Seth Rogane's voice in it. What's it called? Wiener Roast or some shit. Legitimately. The Hunger Games. The books, too. That entire series would have been better if intended for an adult audience and not yaw. Would have paid good money to see Megan Fox vs. Vibratron in Transformers. Optimus Prime could have been his anagramic alter ego moisture pimp. Let's see what other comments there are. Harry Potter. I want to see Dumbledore pound McGonagall. Underworld Evolution The Two Popes Sucker Punch Let's see what other comments there are. Top Gun. That movie has so much homoeroticism. I feel a sex scene involving Iceman plowing Maverick hard would actually make it feel less gay. Twilight. Would watch it for that only. 
Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. The sound of music these are a few of my favorite things, in bed. Let's take a look at some other comments. Godzilla vs. Kong The Lord of the Rings Let's see what some other people wrote. Starting to see a disturbing pattern in these answers. That's all we've got time for today. Come back tomorrow for another video. In the meantime, leave a comment with your stories and thoughts below. Remember to like and subscribe if you enjoyed and want to see more. Until next time, listeners.